I mean, me and Jacob have been sitting here talking for a good two or three <laughs> minutes now, just about, right? Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I thought... We- <laughs> Mm-hmm. All right, so what's up, guys? This is Team Hard Life Captain Albert Capucci, and I've got Jacked Up Leatherworks here in the house as well. Well, at his house, but in the channel. So um, I know it's been a little while since I've gone live. Um, it's just been it's been really, really crazy busy. Um, and even then, right now, we were talking, and I thought I was live, but and I was like, what? no one's chiming in yet. Well, I wasn't even live myself. <laughs> That was on me, like you know. <laughs> but what's up, Patrick and Jay Fishing Maniac? How you doing? All right, we got seven people watching, and we got five thumbs up. What's up, Hyman? How you doing? Hi, man. Um, yeah, I got some pretty, pretty important news, some great news, and some even better news. So yeah, I got a little bit of all levels. Yeah, so I'm cool. I'm, I'm pretty- Pretty, pretty stoked right there. Anita, John, Jaime, Luke, Henry. What up, guys? How y'all doing? Hi, Anita. Oh. Yeah. Oh, the pin. Ooh. Wow. That's pretty sick, bro. That's pretty sick. Man, I need... <sighs> yeah, this is the it, one but... that you made me. Yeah, I saw that one in the in the little feed there that we had, or have. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Took four guys over an hour. Wow. Nice. Well, I don't know, guys. I'm I'm still like, I don't. I mean, I guess on a charter they do it so everybody can experience, you know, a big old catch or whatever. But I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm greedy like that. If I get on a fish, I'm not getting off until you have to. I'm carried off. Like, I, I'm, I'm going to fight that from start to finish. It's just me. Like, I'm sorry. I, I, I You know, I, I've been mm-hmm. brought up that way. You know, if I hook into a fish, I set the hook. If I don't give up the rod to, like, help somebody out or whatever, then I'm, that's my fix. Like, I'm going to, if he kicks my butt, cool. If I kick his butt, even better. If, if, you know, if he breaks up, that that's all on me. You know what I mean? Just, yeah. yeah. Yep, yep. Oh, wow. So I bet you that video is going to go nuts if they were live on TikTok. Yep, yep. Oh, okay, cool deal. Yep. And we uh, we used to actually have dirty hooker um, apparel in our shop um, a few years ago mm-hmm. and stuff like that, but it was real slow moving. Like, it, it took... It didn't, it wasn't really a hot seller. The stickers would sell, but that the shirts and all that they they wouldn't sell. I mean, I did sell some. Don't get me wrong, I, I'd sell some, but not a lot. So, yeah. All right. <laughs> no, I've not been fired yet. I just got on, but I almost fired myself because I thought while I was alive, and me and Jacob were going on and on. I was like, "Why is it nobody watching the channel?" And then I looked, and went in live. <laughs> It's Friday, guys. Like, it's been a long, long, crazy week. So, now that we got 21 people watching, I'm going to go ahead and give you all a little rundown of some great news. All right. First off, I'm going to give you all, I'm going to read out a list of reels that we are expected that have shipped out today. So, we should have them by Monday, Tuesday. Uh, Let's see. Two, two, two. Where's it at? Where's it at? There it is. We're going to be getting one LX Raptor in silver, one T Rex 130, one SX Raptor gunmetal, one T Rex 80 two speed, one HXW Raptor in blue with a silver spool and silver handle. We got an MXL Raptor in blue coming in, an SXJ left hand in silver coming in, and an LX Raptor in green coming in. Yes, that's a that's that's a that's gonna be probably two boxes of reels that are coming in. So um, yeah, like I said, guys, we're, we're we've got all these reels on order. Um, as soon as they get to their invoice, they're 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 hooking us up and getting it getting the gear out here and stuff like that. Um, 
we received another small box, but it was of just the screws and stuff like that. So I was kind of in a hurry to get the reel out for the customer, but it, it, he hasn't come by. He's been, he's been busy. So that one right there, you know, like I said, we've had a lot of reels on order for a long time and we're getting them in. And that is just, for us, that's some, that's some great news because like I said, we've been kind of twiddling our thumbs kind of deal. You know what I mean? Staying busy, making leaders, but now we can get some reels in. Um, I also did co get confirmation that Gator Lures is sending out 60 more of the three ounce Gator Silver Spoons that are coming in. They'll probably be here Monday. Um, we are also getting an order in a uh, Tightline Braid, 60 pound, 65 pound, 80 pound, and 100 pound test in multiple colors. Um, and then also, too, I got my award letter today, guys. I'm up to 70% for VA disability. Good yes. deal. Oh, man. It, it, it was that, and, you know, they put a nice chunk of change into the account, and that enabled me to, like, rejuvenate the shop where we need to be rejuvenated. So, um, with that being in mind, we are also taking on another rod builder that's going to help us out, get caught up, and also help us maintain uh, one of the rod builders is going to be going full time into rod building come the end of the month. So, nice. probably, yeah, we got rods on the way. They are coming in. He's confirmed we've got some rods coming in. I don't. I didn't get into say which ones because he's been working full time at his job. Um, he's trying to get as many hours in as he can before he's he he won't be able to because they they are officially retiring him with the VA saying he's unemployable. So because of that, he's trying to put whatever he can into that. So that way, when he does get off, then he's got some nice money to sit on for a nice little nest egg to sit on. So, uh, yeah. but yes, um, that is, that's been some great information for me and all of that. And then one of the things I had to go do, because I was like, man, I can't wait till I can actually go out and do that. And what that is, is to go get this. Let's see. Do, 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 do. The super oh, nice. combo. <laughs> and it was free. Yes. <laughs> the things like what? 1500, 2500 or something like that for the super combo for here for Texas for hunting and fishing. Lifetime. Yep. Right. Oh man, I, I I'm sorry. I, I had to. I had. I was like, I gotta go. I gotta go now that I know I can do this. I, I went ahead, and took advantage of it. I mean, that's awesome. So, yep. Uh, I'm uh, marido. I hope I said that right. Uh, I I don't know what language that is. It almost looks like Spanish or Italian. One of the two. But uh, welcome to the channel, guys, uh, all the new subscribers that are here. Um, we are actually, and it's Friday, guys, so guess what today is? Fire Grind Day! <laughs> the last, man, the last one went for $1,020 for our last fire drawing. And uh, hold on real quick. I got I to gotta cut a check real quick for, let's see. Do, 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 do. And let me see this. But yeah, no, we are, we've been crazy busy. Um, and like I said, I haven't been able to go live like I normally like to and stuff like that. Uh, and because of that, I wanted to uh, get with y'all today and see what the deal is. Uh, what's up, Mike? Uh, yeah, I, I feel you there, boss. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I just went live on the channel real quick. If you give me, yeah. yeah, I just went live on my channel. Really? Me, yeah, yeah. You see the? Oh, you can't see the video. Um, <laughs> hold on. Let me see. Where is there? It is. Let's do this. There it is. 
Um, but yes, we are. We are. Definitely moving forward, and like I said, with with the announcement of all those reels coming in, that is going to give us some great uh, momentum going forward. Because now it shows that we, it's back on track with Avid and stuff like that, which is what we definitely needed. Um, were they still Were they still trying to ramp up from when everything was shut down? A lot of it was that, and then also having to reset up with the company that was doing the anodizing and stuff like that. And then also, too, they did they did drop down on a lot of workers and stuff like that. So uh, they, yeah, it's been crazy, crazy. So, yeah, and yeah, especially for you, like I said, I mean, with setting up a new tackle shop where you're at, Nobody has the reels that we're that you would be carrying, so everybody would be going to you instead of coming over here or going, you know, online to make purchase. Because there's only one other shop, and it's down the down the way over there. But a lot of people come over here because of the customer service they get here. Really, and then with you, me setting you up over there, I'd be advertising your shop there, saying, "Hey, oh, go wow. over here and go That'd make purchase," cool and they'll be going right to you. You gotta set this shit up. I'm waiting on you, bro. Like I'm ready. <laughs> so. Um, but you want some more, huh? Some yeah. More yes. I'll break one out. Start tonight and then have it ready for you tomorrow. Okay. I'll stop by tomorrow. All right. So, all right, boss. Well, thank all right. you. Sounds good. Thank you. Yes, sir. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. That's the other thing too. Our, our lead supply is is back on track too. So, you know, we y'all saw that sixty two hundred pound block of lead we just got in or something like that. It's already gone. <laughs> So we gotta we gotta go get another block or, or two and stuff and yeah. What's up, Voodoo Craig? How you doing? Uh, Hello, Craig. Uh, get smoked to the holiday break. Hey, MB, no joke on that, man. I, I've seen a lot of spring break weekends where guys catch over ten foot sharks on spring break week. So yeah, they they, they are here, bro. So be ready for it, and uh, most definitely gonna go for that. Uh, yeah, bro. Uh, I've been waiting for that rating for a long time. But I think they only took it back, you know, to December. So I know I submitted my paperwork the year before and was waiting for them to, to do their thing and, and get the upgrades and do all of that. So I don't know. I got to call them and figure out what's going on. Um, I also got to add my, my family into that as well, my dependents, because right now it doesn't have any of my dependents in there. So... I know once that gets in there, it'll be retrograde again, so I'll get a nice little chunk. But also, too, my kids will be able to go to school. That's like, you know, a big thing right there. Now we don't have to really stress about that. And then yeah. once I get up to 90%, then taxes at the house will be no more, which will be good. You know, we don't have to worry about it. That good, you know, about $4,000 a year at minimum. And that's only going to be keep going up, but not for us. That's awesome, you know, so... Yep. So Overland is in the house. How you doing, boss? Overland, how many subscribers are you up to now, boss? I want to see if, if your channel's been growing too, because if y'all don't know, guys, uh, y'all are new to the channel. Overland America was the company, or is the company that supplied the jeeps for us to be able to go down beach to do the beach cleanup. And so while we were down there, you know, everybody down beach was just they were they were in shock and awe because. There's a company that is local here that allows you to rent four by four vehicles that are not run down, that are not, you know, these are all top notch vehicles to be able to go down there and enjoy yourself with peace of mind, knowing that you're not going to break down or even worst case scenario, you have to call for help. They have a way for you to call for help, no matter how far down the beach you are. So, you know, I, it's see. definitely handy when you're driving a Ford. Uh, <laughs> are, are the Jeeps Ford? I don't. I don't know. No, the Broncos. Huh? The Broncos. Oh yeah, we got new phones. <laughs> they're, they're, they're loud. They're loud. Which is good because now, no matter where we're at, we can hear the phone if we're in the front or the back. We 
don't have to sit there with the phone in our hand kind of deal, which is awesome too. Um, I'm looking, looking for something, but what is going on? What was that? I just saw you swipe the screen or something. Oh. Yeah, true that. The Jacks are, are in. Um, they haven't been going crazy. They've been catching them. They're, they're, they're in. But I'm waiting for, it'll probably be next week when they go off where they're probably, you know, 50 to 100 of them caught in a day kind of deal. So, oh, you were cleaning the screen. <laughs> I saw it go white for a second. So, Oh, have some bad news for you. What's that? Uh, looks like my October trip is going to be put on hold. What's going on, boss? If you can talk about it. Uh, well, because of the the plane ticket and everything else, it was going to cost me right around three grand. Wow! Wow! So. <laughs> Well, I'll keep playing the lottery, brother, and if I, if I can win that and get you down here, we'll do it. Okay. I mean, it's <laughs> the only way to because down. I've been really wanting to get back to Texas to, you know, to go fishing and see everybody and, you know, get some of that salt air in my damn, well, yep. my beard. <laughs> <laughs> Lungs and beard. <laughs> yeah. Because I ain't got no hair on top of my head, so. <laughs> true that, true that. What's up, Chris? How you doing? There you go. And, yeah, that's awesome. I'm glad the phone's ringing off the hook, brother. I'm glad that that's, that's going on, man. Um, did you already get fully booked out for Sharkathon? More than likely, he already is. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, well, yeah. just be careful with the traffic, guys. The, I know the police are going to be really watching the spring break traffic and stuff like that coming in. So, you know, you're going to get there. Just take it easy. Take it easy. That's all I can say. Uh, yeah, there you go. Chris has got a what? good one. The winner one of the raffle and use that toward the toward a plane ticket. <laughs> if we if we sold plane tickets here. <laughs> I mean, we got we gotta see what's up. Or you do a raffle on yours. Ah. I could do that, but the way things are if if things keep going the way they're going, I would actually have to stop taking orders. Because right now I'm I'm just about booked up until May. Wow. Well, at least they know where they stand. <laughs> I mean, you know, that that's gonna be pretty sweet. Did you, did you think you would be ever hit this road crossing where you're like that far out and work? No. No, especially when I first started because. You know, when I first started this, it was just going to be something something to do when I got off work or on the weekends or whatever. Mm -hmm. And now it's, I wouldn't be able, I, if I had a regular job, I would not be able to keep up with the orders. That I, I can't keep up with them now. <laughs> Growing pains, brother. Growing pains. Yeah. Yeah, and the taxes are showing it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I, I bought fishing tackle yesterday, and it jumped up about 25% on cost. 25, yeah. to, 25 to 30, no, 25 to 35, maybe 40% went up in cost for yeah. just, you know, and that was hooks and stuff like that. Um, I'm, I'm, wow, I'm blown away. Like, it, it's, it's getting crazy on the amount of money it takes to maintain a business 
And then they want to be taxing us right on top of all of that, too. If we're barely making it, you know, kind of deal. But, hey, we're going to turn and burn for sure. Yep. And also, too, so it is 425. I'm going to go ahead and give it to, let's say, 6 o'clock for the fire drawing tonight, guys. $20 buy-in. And we'll sell tickets all the way till 6 o'clock. And it's four in store credit here at the shop. The last one went for a thousand and twenty dollars. At the time, we finally sold the tickets or stopped selling tickets because nobody. We kind of call the time, you know. We'll say six o'clock, but normally by the time I get over there, it's probably six o five, six ten. When last minute tickets come through, we're gonna take them, guys, just because it's just building the pot for y'all. Like, why am I gonna turn yeah. around another way to? You know, get you another hundred bucks, two hundred bucks, three hundred bucks at the last minute. You know, so, exactly. Uh, yeah. But with that being said, like I said, one of our winners, um, well, the last one, he he went ahead and upgraded to a rotten real combo, and then even too the one before that was Miss Carol. She did the same. She got a rotten real combo. It's like the gear is getting out there, guys. It is getting up there, which is great. So. I'm almost done with this color spool right here. You're going to have to go to a new one and see. Mm -hmm. That's what I'll try not to do. Oh, I'm actually build, I'm making a koozie right now in between stuff drying. It's for a, a marine up here. Oh, wow. Okay. Overland, you have a good one, brother. You be safe. Ah, that looks sweet. <laughs> yep, yep. And it's about time for me, too, to get another wallet. Or I don't know what I'd have to do, but it's... Uh... Oh, I know. You're, you're in rotation right now. Trust me. <laughs> yep. Need more sharpies too. Yep. Uh, so, how long are you going to be down, MB, when you come in? Are you staying for the week or for a few days? <clears throat> oh yeah, and we hit twenty-one thousand subscribers. I know I kind of posted it on the community page, but we already hit twenty-one thousand. So that means we need less than four thousand more subs to go for our next round of giveaways and again two guys the only way to do it is to be sharing objective leatherworks youtube channel link and my youtube channel link you can send them as two that's two entries to each social media platform that is out there <laughs> yep so that's the way to do it and i almost wanted to do that little speech by iron man when he said you know that's the way granddad did it and it has worked before or whatever. <laughs> I don't know exactly how he said it in the Iron Man at the very beginning, but yeah, that was cool. And there's so that, Craig, Craig and Carol yeah. are in it. That's four tickets. So we're at For everybody that right just there. came in. The what? This is the pin. This is the pin that Anita made for us for the giveaway. This is a custom made pin. She made this on her on her lathe and everything. So this is custom made pin that's going to be part of the giveaway. Uh, which giveaway, boss? Your 25K. Oh, oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. I forgot. She she donated that one. So, yeah. And big shout out to uh, Anita for that. So, awesome. Alright, there's Craig and Carol right there. Got him under voodoo. <laughs> he got the the fishing voodoo right there. So we're up to eighty dollars on tonight's fire drawing. Keep a little tally right here, and we're going to check cash app real quick. And I already had hey. somebody offer me eighty dollars for my pen. I told him to get bent. <laughs>
Is that knucklehead waking up or no? Let's see. All right, let me check. Do -do. Oh, I don't know, zero. We might all be getting fired here in a little bit. Oh, man. He's waking up from his nap. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> 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 oh, man. What's up for live? Henry, how you doing? Ooh. Going on, Henry. Roger. Yeah, damn, that looks like a good trip there, uh, MB, right there. Nine sandbars. Damn. Nice. And they were up close. He's talking 200, under 200 yards. Yeah, yeah. That's oh, definitely wow. when you got to you, you find the rip current going out and try, try to catch that. But I know we had some real high winds uh, last week or whatever. They're, they're, they were up there and stuff, so. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, nice. And actually, I found a whole bunch of tags from when we tagged a bunch of charts with the Heart Institute and stuff like that. Uh, <clears throat> so I'm going to try and get that over to them and stuff like that. Bit late, but better late than never. I know they reported in a few, uh, multiple catches, uh, but they didn't have a clue of who originally caught it or whatever because it probably was me. Yeah, we, we got hit pretty hard with the move and stuff like that. Um, moving back and forth, the, the gear and stuff. At that time, uh, I was going from my front shop to the back shop. And, you know, it, it was working solo. So I really I didn't have time to go out and do the fun things of fishing and deliveries and stuff like that to, you know, go talk to the guys at the Hard Institute at the time. But um, I'll, get it, I'll get it out there. So... And then maybe, too, they can figure out, you know, how big they've grown, how far they've traveled or anything like that. Um, but most of the sharks were either tagged and here in Corpus, in Galveston, and in South Padre. So that'll be pretty cool. Hey, Chris. Yeah. Ugh. Okay, then, yeah. That. <clears throat> trucking life what's up boss yeah he, he was one of the first people that i let know that i got my rating up on that and stuff so that was pretty awesome I'm telling you that was uh, a big relief to see that it finally got kind of dealt with on that one and yeah let's see on vacation very nice all right guys so right here we're at $100 for tonight's fire drawing. We're going till 6 o'clock. And we're going to go from there. Let's see. Hey, what do you think? Should I do one side red and the other side the yellow? Oh, yeah. I knew, you, I knew you'd see it my way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and even then, if you had some blue in there, because the the reason for that is uh, the Marine Corps has a blood stripe. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, it'd have to be a darker blue. That's more like an aqua. Mm, that almost looks black. It's a dark blue. It's almost like a dark navy blue. Hmm. Let me see. Let me see Wait. something right quick. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah. Santa Claus is here. I mean, Carl. <laughs> Hundred and thirty. Ah, damn it! I, I'm pretty sure he has it in two hundred. So I, um, I definitely need to get to uh, 
see what the deal is on that. Get him, get you what, at least a hundred yards or something like that. Yeah, at least. Yeah, well, I'll get with him. Sorry, I hadn't done it. But... No, it's all right. Well, I'm getting annoyed that I'm yawning. Because this right here, well, both of these are 100 yard spools. Hmm. So I've, I've had this. Now, mind you, it was full when I bought it. Mm -hmm. Okay. I bought this two and a half months ago. So. Yeah, but also, too, you're also increasing in the amount of production you're putting out compared to two months ago. Oh, God. <laughs> I've already got I've already got an order for more thread of the colors that customers are wanting because I was I was out. Yeah. Oh, man. We are, uh, Patrick, was that you then? What's that? He said, I've been removed from Jacked Up on Facebook. Hmm. I saw some kind of post that, like, you were getting blocked or whatever, or removed or something like that. Oh, yeah, that stupid scam bull crap. <laughs> what, what is that? Well, to, to claim it to. From what the instructions said on that little notice is I had to click the link. So if I didn't click that link, I was going to lose my account. And I'm like, yeah, I'm not clicking. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. And 24 hours later, I still had my account. So <laughs> that's, that's how they get you. They, they do that full 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 man's deal and stuff like that and even too like no, sir, no. i'll get a pm from my buddy that's a friend on there and like uh hey boss uh can you help me and so right there i automatically tell him how do i know you like or how do you know me like so it, it forces them to give some kind of oh, bro we've known each other for da, 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 you know all right bro what's up well, how can i help you but they're like oh no i've just seen how you are like you know and, and but I need to borrow 200 bucks. Like, okay, you got to tell me how you know me before I even have that kind of conversation. Otherwise, because that's the only way for me to know that it's not some scam artist out there. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, yep. Uh, yep. The drawing is up to $100, guys. We're at $100. So, um, Let's see, hold on real quick. Okay, Patrick, I'll 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 take a look at my page as soon as we're done here. So uh and if I did block you, I'm I apologize. <laughs> if I did block you, I'll uh I'll unblock you. Sorry about that. <laughs> Yeah, the fire is 140. Okay, let me see. Let me see in the cash app real quick. There we go. We're we got high man there, and we also got Carl Moon. So we're up to 160 on the, the fire drawing. And we got 34 people in here. Very nice. That's what that I'm talking about. And we're only at 23 I, thumbs up, guys. Come on, man. I'd about to say that gives a whole opportunity for 11 people to smash that thumbs up right now, and it's free. So just go smash it. Yeah, yeah, it is free. It is free. And also, too, we do see quite a bit of new names out there and stuff like that, guys. Do, don't be afraid to, to engage with the channel, guys. It is really awesome to get to know the guys that are on here. Um, there's a lot of big hearts. Um and a lot of knowledge willing to be shared, you know. We don't allow any trolling here. And it is, it's pretty sweet. Uh, <laughs> all right, guys. We're, we're at uh, $180 for the tonight's fire drawing. I've got Real Living, Carl Moon, and... Oh, Santa. 
<laughs> and Santa. <laughs> All right, so Jeff, just a heads up. When you were gone last Friday, they were talking about that they would um, take you out for lunch oh. and also get you a bottle of crown if you were Santa Claus for this year's Christmas. See, when I said crown, he went, he was like, he was oh, about to say oh, no, and then he was like, how big a bottle? So now, now he's now he's calculating. He's doing the beautiful mind deal. It's like, yep. <laughs> Take it easy, MB. All right, MB, you have a good one, boss. Yep, yep. So I know. I, I think it was Edgar that was talking about doing the uh, the bottle there. So I don't know. We'll see. Um, I thought it was a bottle for each one. Oh damn! Big ball of Santa over here. <laughs> <laughs> so somebody never gave me the mark of uh, Maker's 30 Maker's mark. Who? Who are you talking to on the screen? You you told uh Jeff you're gonna give him a Maker's Mark 37 or something like that? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> he he uh, he he gets that look like oh. no no he he remembered he, he <laughs> Maker's 46? Is it? Is it that one? No, oh, it's Maker's Mark. Maker's Mark. Oh, oh okay. Let's it, see. It was a, it's actually a special, it was actually a special batch of Maker's Mark. All right. And we are up to 180. I'm checking Cash App real quick, guys. So... Oopsie, let's see. Delete a message. Cross. There you go. Um, CJ, are you uh, deleting messages in your pocket again? <laughs> okay, well, well, I uncovered it over here. I don't know if it if it did anything. Like it had it, it had it blocked. But can y'all see it now? Or no? I don't know. It scrolled up there. I can't see it anymore. Oh, okay. Okay. All right, guys. I was going to add the Instagram thing, but again, this can't talk through one main word. And since a regular message was going to wrong hand, it's going to Okay. All right, guys. Yeah, so Toby. Who, who's going fishing? Go ahead, sorry. This oh, go ahead. Um, all right, guys. For those of y'all that are just chiming in, I'm going to re read off the list of reels that are coming in, guys. We, we got a big list. A um, bunch of them. We, yeah, they shipped, <laughs> they, they shipped out from Abbott today. We are getting one silver LX Raptor, one blue T Rex 130, one SX Raptor gunmetal, one T Rex 80 blue, one HXW Raptor in blue, one MXL Raptor in blue, and one SX left handed SXJ MC G2. And then we're also getting one LX Raptor in green coming in. Yes. Nice. Yes. That's, that's, <laughs> that was a lot of reels right there, especially since we've been kind of one, two or three reels. And now they're, they're throwing all of that out there. And so, yes. So we got a lot of guys that are going to be very happy next week and more than likely probably Monday, they'll have another list for us or Tuesday. You know, uh, like I said, they're, um, they look like they combined a couple of invoices there and stuff like that. Cause like I said, when people were buying the reels one or two a day, you know, every other week I was, I was posting them in there and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, nope. We're at $180 right now for the fire drawing guys. We're at 180. So every time I get a hundred, I'll pull off the tag and we got five there. So to make it easy so I can double check real quick. And I'm also keeping track. They're there. So, uh, uh, all right. Let me get back to that. That is over here. That takes us back up to 1050 Oh, excuse me. $1,051 is where our Green Cross Fund is. Oh, 
Carson. There we go. So we're at 1,051. And as you can tell, we uh, Jeff installed our new phones, and they're loud as hell. <laughs> so, which is good. It's good. But we had to fill so many orders the other day. Um, several shops we uh, we supplied out. Um, Ann's Bait House. Causeway, Red Dot, uh, no, no, not Red Dot, uh, The Bait Bucket, um, 40 Outfitters, Tackle Town, and um, Fisherman's Place all got fishing gear from us this week prepping for spring break. So, yes, we are doing that. <laughs> that week. Oh no, the garden gnomes! <laughs> so he's he's definitely got to be froze on the screen because I look over and you're just sitting there staring at it. It must have been the split second you looked up and it finally moved just now. <laughs> oh, oh no, I was reading uh, Patrick's comment. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. But, yeah, we're up to 28 watching, so we, we lost a few people, but uh, I'm glad we're, we're, we're over 20, 20 people on the channel watching and participating. Um, it helps that you're commenting on here and saying what's up and, you know, talking fishing, talking whatever it is that we're talking about and stuff like that. And they've got CJ right there. And yeah, it, it is really building a, a, a true brotherhood of uh, fishermen out here, male, female, I'm saying we're family, should we say it, you know, that way we can all know that we are up and ready to go fishing whenever, whenever somebody can make it in and stuff like that, you know, we don't have to be dependent on just one person here locally, you know, several are all, all coming in at the same time, y'all can group up because, you know, y'all, y'all all want the same thing go out and have some fun and stuff like that so most definitely pretty awesome mm -hmm. um didn't they have the uh the hunting and or the fishing expo in houston last weekend or this week something like that this week uh this week coming up oh okay so mm. i only know because uh a buddy of uh, a, a guy i know that makes baits he's going to it Oh, okay. What was that? <laughs> that was carrot cake, wasn't it? You dirty bastard. And I'm look, you can see you. the pieces of carrot in there. Like I'm not talking to you. And Go look, away. and you can even see the nuts too. Like, Go away. Yeah, I'm looking at one right now. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Sorry. <laughs> heaven smells like heaven. <laughs> Don't smell it. Scratch the screen. Scratch the sniff. <laughs> you know what I'm doing to you in my mind right now, right? <laughs> I mean, it's thick, guys. Like, super. Look. <sighs> that that is just wrong on so many levels. <clears throat> Don't choke on it, okay? I wouldn't. I wouldn't want you to choke. The devil Jacob on the other shoulder is like this. <laughs> that is a bed of cream cheese on top. Yep. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm sorry, guys. I got to take another bite down with just. Mm. Oh, sure. Rub it in. I'm not rubbing it, I'm televising it in. 
Oh, I know he's doing it on purpose. He knows how much I love carrot cake. And you notice, too, I have not had to take a drink because it's so moist. Really? Really? Oh. <laughs> this freaking guy. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep. Oh man, that was good. Oh, you know where you could go. <laughs> I'm enjoying my way down. <laughs> yeah, nice. <not>, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was good. That was real good. Yeah, I bet it was. I tried the other day. I think I ate like four bites and I was full for like an hour. I couldn't eat anymore. It's like, geez, just off of four bites. Like, awesome. Awesome. Well, it doesn't help that he, he makes those things thick. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. We, I had to tell him. Well, we told him. It was me and Jeff. We were telling him that we like the cake, but we like it with like some some sustenance, not just all cake. Like we like it, you know, with some some actual, you know. Um, yeah, because uh, there's some carrot cakes out there that just it's like you pick it up and it's like some cheesy factory made it that didn't know what the hell they were doing. I bet I, I bet you I could put this on the on the. You know what? I am gonna do that. Hold on, I got I got something for y'all. You gonna put it on a scale? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you what? That carrot cake ain't like a brick. I don't want it. Uh, Takes even better though. All right, here we go, guys. And it's only like half now. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Almost, almost ten ounces for that little bit right there. <clears throat> I'm telling you, and that, and like I said, when I first when I first got it. Uh, it's probably probably a third of what it was. And it's probably close to two pounds. Yeah, yeah. Brand new, it'd probably be close to two pounds. That's for sure. <clears throat> nice. All right, y'all get everybody start getting in the drawing. Let's get this thing going. What was that? Huh? What was that? I said, Albert's a jerk for doing that to me and showing that big, juicy, freaking carrot cake. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, no doubt, for sure. So Now, I've had some carrot cakes that were, I mean, they said carrot cake, they had flavor of carrot cake, but they had no texture of carrot cake. They were light as a donut. Like that one, that's that's pretty heavy for that. So I like it, yeah. <laughs> um, hey, shh, don't be telling nobody. We're moving some weight over here. Oh man! <laughs> yep, yep. But trust me, we've we've battle tested our toilets. They can take a beating. They really have. Yep, yep. I really didn't want to know that. <laughs> oh, you look at Hymas. This is Hymas post. <laughs> Jesus Christ! 
<laughs> oh man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, so last night my son had that little roller uh wheel deal where you hold on to and you you you're on your knees and you extend out and you pull back and you extend out. So he did yeah. it the first time he got like two or three. And my son-in-law got up there and he did 25 or 26. And then I went up there and I did 15. Well, I did six the first time, you know, when they, they were trying it out. When my, my son did it, he got like six or five or six the first time. My son-in-law went out there and did 20-something. My son got back on it and he did 20, I think he did right at 20, 21, something like that. And then I went out there and only did like 15 or 16, but... At first, I was kind of a little worried about how my hip was going to feel, but my hip actually did really well. It was my stomach muscles that were saying, hey, you stupid. <laughs> too much of that carrot cake. <laughs> yeah, they, they, they could definitely take that sucker punch for sure, Jaime, I mean, or trucking right there. Yep. So, yeah, no, I did it. And then my daughter was getting on it and stuff like that, so. I had I had not did a core workout on my stomach like that in since bef- about two or three months before my surgery, so I am doing some some workouts here and there and stuff like that too. So, uh, but yeah, all right, guys, we're coming up at five o'clock. We are gonna we're on our fire drawing. We're up to a hundred hundred and eighty dollars on it. We're gonna keep going until six o'clock. And like I said, I'm just um. I'm excited that everything that's been going on today here at the shop to get us moving forward for sure has been, you know, a real blessing, you know, to enable us to make the moves that we were able to make today. I was able to get my lifetime hunting and fishing, you know, license today. That was pretty awesome. Yeah. And uh, it was funny because uh, she goes, well, um, I can't refund you how much you paid for this. And I said, I don't care because I'm getting a lifetime. Like, like I mean, I, I, you know, she goes, you don't want to wait. I said, I don't know. I don't want to wait. They're like, oh, just, just give me the lifetime. Like, I don't have to worry about it. She goes, well, you know, next yep. year you got to I say, I know I got to repeat the process. No worries. But, yeah. No worries. I was totally okay with not getting my money back from that. No worries. It was only 40, 40 something bucks you know, when I got my fishing license. Yeah. Is that the dog? Mm-hmm. Yep. yep. Oh, man. Let's see. Yep. Mr. Beach Bomber. I think he may have butt dialed me because it started to ring and then it didn't. So, either that or he sees us online here. Let's see. I'm going to text him. I'm live if he wants to chime in. Let's see. Uh, the tags for hunting. I don't know. I've never, never bought my tags for hunting. The reason being because, you know, I always just fish and I've always been invited out to go hunting, but I just never bought the tag for it. So I always had to turn down those trips. You know, if I was going to go, I was just going to be the camera guy on the last ones that we had some uh, trips donated for the vets that ended up falling through. We didn't, those trips never, never went through. So uh, not not because I didn't want them to. I wanted to go because that would have been some awesome footage. It would have been real cool, you know, so. But what's up? There's Edgar. Okay, Edgar. Uh, we were telling Jeff about the Santa deal that you were proposing. I know. Uh, I think it was Four Live said he would take him out to breakfast, and you were prom- You were talking about a uh, a little one shot bottle of Crown. What? <laughs> 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 he almost he almost said yes there for a second. Like, oh, oh, wait a minute, hold on. That that's not what we were talking about. <laughs> You got any more um, snap souls? Like the size ones, the size three. Then all oh. they come here. Okay. 
Can you go get me some? Too? Uh, just bring that big old bag up. I'm, I'm working on the three way shorts right now so we can get those up on the wall. We got a ton of three way swivels in today. So, yeah. Um, you get one? Oh, yeah. oh, Edgar, what a do, what a do, brother. So, yeah. yeah, we are up to $180 on tonight's fire drawing, and we're going till 6 o'clock. Well, I'll put it down for 200 I'll throw in 20 as soon as we get off here. Oh, man, let's see. Waiting on some more snap tools to come real quick, but oh man. Mm. <laughs> I wanted to so, so screenshot that second you came and sat down before you took a bite of pizza. I don't know, it was just frame of thought you were eating, it would have been pretty funny. <laughs> All right, so what what he's asking what size of bottle is what he's asking, and I didn't know about the jerky beef jerky one, so I'm uh, damn man, <laughs> he almost bit his finger. <laughs> Right now, they're tearing up the sheephead and the redfish on the backside of the packery in, in the Bay Area right there. They're really tearing them up, so just a heads up on there. Oh, man. Let's see. Hmm. Oh. Can't believe I'm still yawning, like. I finished the Red Bull, and I'm about halfway down to that. Yeah, now got to run an anniversary weekend. Here now for the weekend, go to. Well, happy anniversary, truck and life, to you and your wife, bro. Man, that's awesome. Yep, happy anniversary. Yeah. Uh, three twenty-five twenty-six. That's in two weeks. Let's see, ah. Uh, Well, I got to see what the deal is right there, boss, because I definitely want to get out there and do those those casting events because it's just it's getting more knowledge out there for all of us uh, that are intending on fishing with that type of knowledge on casting. So, yes, I definitely want to get back out there um, and do some more casts and stuff like that, because I really what I really need to do is just go out here and just practice casting on the water <clears throat> just because. Uh, when I cast on the water, it allows me to, you know, cast out and cast out and wet the lines where I don't have to keep drying, you know, re-wetting the line as I'm walking up and spooling up and stuff like that. And um, I can get more casting time in and stuff. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. Um, and also, too, in the meantime, I can get maybe some, uh, some time on the water in the kayak, you know, kayaking some bait or something like that. And I, I'm not even going to lie, I mean, I'd rather get the jet ski out there and do it. <laughs> but we got to see what the dealio is with the weather and stuff like that. What was the weather down there today? Beautiful. Not, it's bre There's a breeze and stuff, but it's not heavy and stuff. Um, uh, Janice Tackle will have some in April and I prefer to buy from you. Okay, hold on. Uh, Abby can find out. Um, yes, yes, Jaime, we can get those in. And actually, your SXJ uh, left handed is, uh, silver is coming in. So, and oh, in left hand, I will have to see what they're doing on that on the left handed. Um, I didn't fully read that. Uh, I know they do the Superman colors, but I know they're going to do them in left hand. 
But if they are, then most definitely we got to put our orders in for that so we can get them reels in and stuff like that. Because if they're really going to do it, then most definitely, yeah. Got a few people that have ordered them here for us and stuff like that. And we actually got them in a reasonable time compared to a lot of the other orders that we've been waiting for and stuff like that. So. Dang, it's cold over there, bro. <laughs> Negative 20. Yeah, we, we had snow this morning. How much? It was only about four inches or so. Hello. Uh-oh. Ooh, dun, dun. Dun, dun. Look, dun, there's dun. Albert. Dun, dun. Aha. <laughs> uh-huh. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> he knew he was on camera. He's like, I got this. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah, I'm going to come get another piece real quick. No, I was, was going to say what's up, and he fired me before I could. <laughs> <laughs> and he just got you again. Yep, yep. <laughs> what's up, Daniel? Ah! <laughs> oh, what you man. The what? What do you want, monkey? <laughs> Okay. Hang on, there you go. Uh, Carl, what's what's uh, Daniel's prediction for what time your rod will be done? Hey, let's go watch Sandlot. Come on. Ooh, Come on, Ooh you go watch the Sandlot. Uh, hey. Everybody saying hi, Daniel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hi, Albert. Hey, how you doing? Better. I'm getting there. Yeah, that's one day at a time. One day at a time. I heard you were eating carrot cake in front of Dad. <laughs> oh, that's First pizza, now carrot cake. What's wrong with you? <laughs> You're evil. No, are you? Did you come from hell itself? <laughs> I know. Devil spawn over here. Yeah, okay. Oh, come on. You know what? I'm going to go get another piece of pizza and eat it. <laughs> Revenge! Yeah, okay, I'll take that over the pizza. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, you can see the nuts and the carrot all in there, and, and there's so much icing. Every time I take a bite, it just it just oh mixes God. in with it. It's so, and look how moist it is. I know y'all can see how moist it is. Like, Oh, yeah. That's why I love. That's why I love carrot cake so much, especially his. Because I know every time I was up at the shop and he came in, I had like two of them. <laughs> Here, can you just hand me that box of Supreme? <laughs> I feel like going back over there all all the damn time. <laughs> Save me a drink. Nope. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> um. You know, growing up with four brothers, you definitely learned how to torture each other. <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. Now we're good. Oh, lay him, uh huh. <laughs> oh man, what? No pineapple? <laughs> no, nah, I didn't want pineapple this time. I just wanted to spring. There you go. There you go. All right. So, ooh, that'll be cool. A reburner. I think it's called. Yeah. Yeah, it's in there pretty good. Yeah. Reburn. Reburn. Y'all can make the judgment call, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I had it on there. Let's oh, see. Wait to reburn. Uh-huh. That's where they signed the ball, right? It was the primitive part. Primitive. Mm. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna get yeah, man. That's what I'm talking about. That they're bringing down some moonshine cherries. It's mm -hmm. Okay. Last time I did that, I didn't remember the night. Huh? Uh, what? The last yeah, time I did that. Oh, 
But I haven't seen him in a while, so I'm waiting oh, for him. To- I haven't seen him since the time. He's supposed to be with me the five. Oh, nice. Okay. Just send me at least yeah, one piece. He was, he was part of that show, that moonshining show there, too, or doing, yeah. I think he did one episode. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't know what went from there, but I know it was during that, that test where they they have to do, like, certain flavors or whatever, make moonshine, and then they have to do the test to see if they even pass or whatever. So. Yeah. Yep. Add some fish bites instead of pineapples. <laughs> <laughs> well, that would be cool if they had flavor, but they have no flavor, so it, yeah, you know, kind of wasted them. I know, I've eaten them, <laughs> I've eaten the fish bites. So we are up to one hundred and eighty dollars on tonight's fire drawing. A little slow today, guys. It's a little slow. But while y'all are doing that, I've been putting leaders together. Oop, I didn't crimp. One liter on one side and one liter on the other. Forget that. Before I go hang them up on the wall. Well, <clears throat> and then know that, uh, like I said, that the shops that we supplied this week, if you go out there and you see that they're low on any of them, let them know because we are stocked up with all kinds of tackle ready to rock at any given minute. So that way, None of our shops should miss out on any sales or anything like that. So we are definitely on it. Yeah, no doubt. I don't need any moonshine, period. I do. Bad things happen when I drink moonshine. <laughs> <laughs> like that tequila song or what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Two, four, six. No, my problem is I don't remember. Let's just say last time I started drinking moonshine, mm-hmm. I was in Tucson, Arizona. Mm-hmm. Woke up the next morning and I was in El Paso. <laughs> wow. Thank goodness I was driving. Man. Yeah, the first time I ever had moonshine, they had it labeled as water in the fridge in a uh, gallon gallon jug we were out there playing basketball in the marine corps and they say hey go get some water out of the fridge all right cool so i grabbed it took a swig i mean a swig and it was too late it was halfway down my throat before i realized what the hell was going on <laughs> wow <laughs> yeah and then when half of it came coughing out went through my nose so like instant i was instantly buzzed Oh Instant. yeah, yeah, it burned. Oh, you poor bastard. Let's see. Dang it, yeah. Jesus. That's yeah, that's and then they were they were also telling me how they test it. You know, they shake it up like that, or they shake it up like that to see how long it takes the bubbles to to rise to the surface and stuff like that. So yeah, yeah, pretty crazy, pretty crazy. So all right, guys, it is five fifteen, and we're up to one hundred eighty dollars on the fire drawing for tonight. Uh, like I said, we got a lot of tackle inbound. I read off the list of the Avid reels we got. Eight to ten of them coming in. To what? Two hundred. Two hundred what? For the fire oh, rifle. You're, you're buying the, the the next ticket. Oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't catch on. All I saw was the peace sign. <laughs> there you go. All right. Cool. All right. So we are at two hundred dollars. There we go. There's our second hundred right there. 
knock that out. And I am busy making the other portion of these leaders right here. We're doing three-way shorts. Mm. Homer! Ooh. Try him. Homer, how you doing, boss? Whoa. I think I might have to throw in the towel here in a minute. Go go take a nappy poo. <laughs> <laughs> Get into that, that sleep coma. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Are you eating the whole pizza by yourself? Oh, good God, no. <laughs> I definitely go into a sleep coma. <laughs> Um, Carl, who are you don't talking even to? repeat it. Don't even repeat it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Channel's been setting up some good, good bear traps out there. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> Damn it, Carl. <laughs> 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 yep, yep. <laughs> no, that was just perfect, perfect timing right there. Damn it, Carl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I used to have a bunch of those saved on my phone. The damn it, C Carl things from the Marine Corps. The memes? Yep. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Oh, man, some of those are pretty damn hilarious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so um, I was talking about that, those snow crab legs. I don't know if y'all saw that. Uh, I don't know. I think it was a TikTok video that I did where um, they had snow crab legs for seven pounds for 33 bucks because they said they had an influx of them or whatever, and they were doing a huge sale just to get their name out there. However, as soon as I put it to, you know, confirm shipping costs and all of that before you, you put in your credit card, credit card info, and it was $9,999 to ship 21 pounds of crap. What the? Yeah. No joke. Check out my TikTok. It's on there. You saw me screen... Screen by screen, doing it like that, and yeah, yeah. You know, it's cheaper for us to fly over there, probably. Oh yeah, yeah, it is way cheaper for us to fly over there and get it. I can probably no drive joke. up there for less. Yeah, no joke. So I was like, yeah. So, <laughs> so I went back on the thing. I said, scam. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Homer, been doing pretty good, guys. Uh, if y'all are just chiming in the channel, um, I did get my award letter uh, today. I got upgraded to 70% for my disability rating for the VA, which is awesome because, man, it, it really, really came through in a pinch for us here. Uh, so with the award letter, it definitely came some fundings that is also going to help us uh, get more inventory because we were getting ready to buy more of the hollow core braid from Thailand braids, which we've got 65 pound, 80 pound and hundred pound coming in. And yeah. Oh, and actually on that note, I need to, hold on. I need to do. -do. <laughs> I haven't oh, seen that one, Edgar. The what? Oh, Edgar was asking if seen the video short of the skier going 
too fast, yells, I can't slow down, and the guy behind him says, Carl. <laughs> no, I did not see that one. <laughs> Send that to me, Edgar, if you got it. $10 a pound for crab claws. Okay, what kind of crab claws? Are we talking rock crab claws, blue crab claws? Like, I mean, those are the only two, huh? If I try to talk to crab. That or even, you know, those, uh, what are those, Dungeness crabs? The, mm -hmm. the, those crab claws? I mean, I hate to say, but the blue crab claw is pretty damn good, but the rock crab claw is awesome. That is. Yeah. Yeah, man, you crack that thing open, you pull ooh, ooh. big old hunk of meat out of that damn thing. Yes, yeah, sir. That that's that is right. Let's see. I mean. Yeah, no, y'all got to check it out. It's on, it's on my TikTok in there, uh, and it, it looks like it's a, a red, red outline on the screen. So when you 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 see this to my phone there, and it, I've recorded it off my phone and stuff like that. I was like, man, that would be awesome because I just saw you know the crab claw king crab claws over here at at Sam's for like fifty bucks a pound. So I, I, I hey, that that is pretty pretty right up on point right there. I mean, for the price that they were trying to do, or whatever. Uh, or no, it was fifty dollars for two pounds here, so it's twenty five dollars a pound. So it, it was like right in that that mark. I was like, well, yeah. maybe they're offering more because you're buying more at a time instead of two pounds. You're buying seven pounds, so yeah. I had to buy three. And yeah, <laughs> I'm okay. No, no, I'm okay. So yeah. <clears throat> Oh yeah. Oh man. Now the one character that I've I've been catching, I don't know for some reason it just happened. The no way guy. No way. <laughs> this has been pretty funny. You know, just with doing the tools and the different little hacks for tools and stuff like that. So I don't know. Thought that was pretty he was uh, he was all right. He's all right. So, got me laughing, so all right, Carl, go check that list. Check it twice. <laughs> Let's see. We are at 522 and we're still at 180 bucks. Oh, no, we're at $200. We're at $200 because Jacob bought that ticket right there. And my own guys, it is Friday. Friday before spring break. Like Friday of spring break. Today was officially what? Senior skip day or something like that? I remember that day. Shoot. Mm -hmm. I think there were 200 and something thousand people out on the beach that day. Yep. Yep. That's some awesome pictures from that day, too. So, And then, what was it? The next year I came back, or two years later, two years later, I came back and uh, I was on vacation uh, while I was in the Marine Corps and stuff like that. And it was spring break, so it was pretty awesome out there and took some awesome photos. You really can. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. So. You're great. Oof. Oh, man. I couldn't live like that. Yeah. Living today. I, yeah, a lot of people did get off early today for spring break and stuff like that. I heard that one, too. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Um, yeah. Uh, let me see. Good Lord. Um, let's see. We're on. There's Toby. 
for forty dollars for the fire grind to die. So we're at two hundred and forty dollars mm. right there. We're at two hundred and forty, and we got thirty-five minutes. I remember one one time we did a beach cleanup there at. Uh, I think it was it was between White Cap and Bob Hall, the Jeep Club I was in. We did a beach cleanup over there right after spring break. Oh my God, Jesus! Yeah, that I bet there was a ton of trash out there. That's what I understand. These guys, I mean, but at the same time too, they put little bitty trash cans out there. Yeah. Instead of putting some, they know it's going to be huge. Why don't they just put some big trash cans out there? Well, they know they're going to have to dump at least two or three times a day. Yeah, I mean, like every hour, go through and do that, or put some big old trash cans out there. I mean, I mean, if yeah. they got to chain them up so they don't get rolled around and stuff like that. But by all means, you know what I mean? But yeah. No, put they, them on the on the markers. Yeah, by the markers. Yeah. Yeah. They know it's going to get trashed, and you know, then everybody bitches and complains and everything else. And it's like, well, yeah, they don't ever, they don't ever put any dumpsters or anything else like that because I swear to God, they take them off the beach when that time comes around. Yeah, they're like, ha ha, let's see how they do with their trash now. No trash cans. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I I got out there in the morning, and you got to remember too, some people come in the night before. The trash yeah. cans are already full the night be from the night before because they yeah. get out there, they camp out, they're partying all night. So the day of spring break, Friday, they're already they're already full. Like they hadn't even come by and picked them up yet. They're already full. So yeah, it's yeah. not nuts. I, I love. I mean, see, I don't know. I guess it's just me. I guess I'm a, that much of a social butterfly. I fish during spring break. I don't care. Like I mean. For the most part, people see the rack and they see how many lines are out. They pretty much, for the most part, we get, they avoid it. Now, uh, we are getting some flags in that will have shark fishing. On. It'll say shark fishing on them. And then other ones will say, you know, no swimming, shark fishing, you know. So that way, leads gives them yeah. a heads up. Hey, we are fishing for shark in here. Not that we've ever had anybody get bit, but it is real interesting to see, well, why are you fishing out here when we're trying to swim? Uh, because I was out here before you and had my lines out before you got here. Like, you just got here. Like, and it's kind of, you know, an open beach. It's not regulated to just uh, the beach goers. It's open to the fishermen, you know? Yeah. What's I, was actually doing a, I was doing a lot of videos showing how we're able to out there shark fish with all the beach goers and still enjoy ourselves. But in other states, they close it down when it comes to stuff like that to allow it just strictly for the beach goer and the fishermen are not allowed to fish out there. Yeah. Like they get into all kinds of trouble because they're out there fishing. Like, but they don't realize that the sharks are already there. We didn't invent them and put them into the water. Yeah, <laughs> <right>. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I remember there was one time I was down there I, and I was just fishing off of the back of the truck and I had I had that LX probably <laughs> probably about 150 yards out. And people just started coming in and, you know, par parking almost right up next to me and everything. And I'm just sitting there going, I'm going to surprise the hell out of them if that thing takes off and I get a shark on the end of that damn thing. <laughs> I ain't nothing wrong with that. And sure, sure enough, man, it's probably about two hours later and everybody was, there were some people out in the water and there was a bunch of people on chairs and everything all around me. And that line started screaming and I was like, okay, it's either a big ray or I've got a, I've got a shark on here. And I caught that five foot bull shark. <laughs> nice. The people were like, get out of the water, get out of the water. <laughs> it's a shark. It's a shark. <laughs> and, I got I got so many people coming up. Says, well, how do you know if there's sharks in the water? I said, put the take a big old drink of the water that you're in, and if it tastes like salt, there's sharks in the water. Yeah, yeah. That is on, the, on the, some of the fresh water. There's going to be sharks in there too because bulls spawn in fresh water. Yeah, yep. 
That they do. I mean, they've caught bull sharks all as far up the river as St. Louis. Yep. They caught a nine, uh, nine foot five female up in the St. Louis. Yep. And that one was over 500 pounds. She was pregnant, too. Yeah. So, yep. <laughs> well, they had that. Uh... I can't remember where the hell it was. It, it was on it was on Facebook or not Facebook. It was on YouTube. I think it was. It was probably about two years ago. In some of the estuaries, uh, I think it was North Carolina, or one of the Carolinas right there, South Carolina, or whatever it was. They they had it. They had a great white in the estuaries. Um, actually, when I was stationed up in Cherry Point, North Carolina, which is in New Bern, North Carolina. Uh, mm -hmm. Or Havelock, Havelock. Sorry, it's in Havelock, the little town of Havelock. And um, we would get reports on the radio that the sound, which is like our Laguna Madre here, the the water behind the island. Yeah. Oh, they've got a 17 foot great wide over here at this mile marker, you know, and then in the sound. So I'd take off in my car real quick, and I would drive over the bridge in that area just to catch a glimpse of it swimming. You know what I mean? Because all those areas, all on both sides of the town, it's all privately owned. Like you had to know somebody to be able to, able to even access that kind of water there. And trust me, I tried like talking to those people and stuff like that, just to allow them to or get them to allow me to go back there and fish, you know, and stuff. But yeah, yeah, yeah. no, they weren't having it. So <laughs> there were no way. <laughs> So, um. Oh yeah, Jacksonville. Yeah, definitely. That is like a big breeding ground for uh, for bulls. <laughs> Look at her said, "Don't just don't splash." Um, <laughs> I had I had one where we were at Indianola and Magnolia Beach. Uh, mm -hmm. It's where both beaches meet. It's right there at the point. I had just caught two bull sharks back to back. And uh, I, I, I mean, I horsed them in, land, landed them like while they were taking out the hook out of the first one, I was already landing the second one like that fast. Wow. Well, we took our pictures and we pushed them back in, literally pushed them back in. A car came flying in under the beach. They skidded up on the sand. They all jumped out and just ran in the water. Before, I mean, we just put them, and they're running in the water as we're turning around, and they're running right where the sharks were swimming like that. <laughs> and there was probably five or six of them. They ran into the water, and it, as soon as they got in, it drops down to like four foot, you know, within a foot from the water's edge or whatever. Yeah. And they're like, yeah. I was like, hey, there's sharks. And they're like, there's what? And you can see the sharks swimming in between them. <laughs> what? Hey. There's sharks. And I was like, man, you what are you doing? Like they were trying to get mad at me. I'm like, I'm not the moron that just ran in the water without looking. <laughs> like, I mean, y'all didn't even look. Y'all, y'all just ran in the water. I mean, their dorsals were on the surface of the water. They didn't even. No, they ran right in front of them, and the sharks did not even mess with them though. Yeah, pretty yeah. crazy. Pretty pretty crazy. So. Yeah, I know. I know some people that uh, still think sharks are out to get them. <laughs> I, I, you know what? I wouldn't say that they're out to get me, but I knew, I do know they have my number. I, I will, I will say that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> There's toilet paper. <laughs> How's the fishing? You're in the silhouette. All I see is black and then the light right there. That's so. what I'm saying, oh, there you are. Okay. <laughs> Look like she got a tanning boot and shit. Horrible. <laughs> 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 I'll tell you that we never fucking get that. Nah, we had to. It's okay. To go okay. Watch the f bombs. I am live. <laughs> <laughs> we took Katie to go. I never get one of those. Okay. Do it. Oh. Well, like, I never get one. Now we took Katie to go. Have some fun. Oh, okay. Is that the, the Doberman? Yeah. Oh, okay. No, I'm not even. Not new one? That. Oh. one. Not little no more. This <laughs> is my first one. Yeah. You got that look like you don't want to mess with him. Nah, he's just dude to fucking get 
if it was my female, my, my female would be like, don't touch me. <laughs> okay, who, which one was it on the beach that night that we went out there? Remember we ran out uh, late at night and went fishing? Him. Oh, okay. It was him. Yeah, he, it was a lot smaller then. So. Yeah, it was him. Yeah. Oh, when you put him on the live or whenever you put him on the TikTok or whatever? Yeah. Chasing yeah. the crab? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Yeah, he was still. Well, I think he was only like a year old. It's been a while. Yeah, it's been a long time. Yeah, yeah. Wow. So he calmed down a lot then. <laughs> hey, a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> yeah. So, well, y'all just in time. We're doing a uh, fire drawn. We're up to two hundred. Well, I'll, I'll pick the numbers. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> so you're gonna get her in it, so y'all can win. <laughs> I mean. It all depends what it is. It's, if it's a chicken eye, I mean, I'll put, I'll put the whole check, baby. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's all the chicken. Oh, my gosh. I didn't, I didn't cook. Yeah. I didn't cook. Yeah. How much is it? Twenty bucks to get in. <laughs> sure. Oh, yeah. Twenty bucks to get in. What is it for? Uh, install credit. Oh, install credit. credit. Yeah, you can yeah. use it for whatever. Yeah, orders. Yeah. Put something on it. Yeah, they're still there though. Some damn money. No, no, we still have the paperwork there. That's that's why we store it. So. Stop. You're my new best friend. The what? The nice. Yeah, they are. What's up, Roger? How you doing, boss? I ain't gonna lie. Them them reds. The I don't like red. On those rollers, they're freaking nice. Mm -hmm. There you go. The uh, big ones are four seven, uh, five seventy nine. But it comes with everything. The landing, yeah, bro. Like, I get, I get a discount. It's my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. No, not for those. What? Not the same rope. It's not the same rope. Nope. Nope. That rope's too thin for that net. I'll use that rope for the smaller nets, the drum nets. That one I'll use that, but not on the big one. The big one is this. Watch. Give me a second. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. This one, this one. Yeah, that's that's for the little one. If you're only going up a or uh, Caldwell or, you know, I mean, not Caldwell. Uh, well, yeah, you can go up Caldwell with it. I make it long enough for that one, but what you would have to do is create a... Uh, a little bigger, baby. Like a donut comes off of uh, a bad boy, baby. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> hey, oh, my God. You would have never thought of that, bro. <laughs> you would have never thought of that. Watch out. <laughs> yeah. It's been a while. I forgot what the sand feels like. Wow. You don't know about that anymore. Another one of these non believers, or that I don't know about it. You don't know about the beach life anymore. You're done. You're, done. you're getting you, old. You heard uh, about the last time they called me out like that, right? Let's go! <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yeah, I need to. I need to, man. Put. Uh, not right now. It's still five footers. I mean, we can get them off the pier all day. Yeah. No, that's where I wanted to go. I wanted to go off of uh, Caldwell just to go casting. I'm going this weekend. I'm going to yak out some baits out. Going on what, Saturday? I'm probably trying to go tonight or Saturday morning. Mm. But I'm going to yak out. I mean, I'm not yakking out far. And I ain't yakking out 80s. Just if I'm if I'm gonna take anything, I'm gonna take, a, I'm gonna take my 50 and LX and AWs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know, see if y'all are out there tomorrow. I'll see what's up tomorrow. Uh, it's just been crazy today. Dude. Oh, I got my I got my word letter for my VA stuff. So check that out. You don't hunt. Hey, but it's there now. But he doesn't hunt. Hey, but get that invite. You know, yeah. yeah, I never really put a lot into it because I never had, you know, doing the hunting part was expensive. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You weren't able to hunt or what? Yeah. Huh? You weren't able to hunt or what? 
well, you got to have a license to hunt. Yeah, yeah. Well, now that I got the super combo for life, I, I can I can start oh, this going. Is for life. Yeah, I just have to refile every year because obviously you know it's yeah yeah it you, do, still gotta, you still gotta follow requirements. Yeah, but so pretty much what I'm saying is you're fucking retarded. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you know he, he, he knows I got a freezer in the back. For, <laughs> we'll put him in the very back with the shit bait. <laughs> <laughs> Who needs enemies when you got your best friends right there? <laughs> yep, there you go. Hey, y'all got 20 minutes, guys. We're up to $240 for the fire drawing. Uh, David's gonna get it. You're gonna get into it or no? How much of a credit? It said two forty. You if you buy one ticket, it takes it up to two sixty. If you put two, then it's two eighty. And yeah, you can send it to Cash App. Just make sure you send it as a gift. Uh, I'm gonna put on there, not gift. <laughs> hey, put on there. Oh, what's up, Ray? How you doing? Um, Triple money. How do you have a cake? Dog eat it. <laughs> yeah. Now that yeah, my my cake is sitting right here. No, no, that dog. Nope. 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 Bought a carrot cake. Oh, yeah. I wait. Well, I took a couple of bites out of it already. Is it good or no? See, there's some people that make it and no. it's. No, no. Is it from the store? No. Uh, uh, it's a church program, I think. Or yeah. Church, it's, a church, it's a church group that makes them, but like you can see the nuts and the carrot yeah. slices. And uh, <laughs> let, me, let me do it again, real quick. I, I just take a <laughs> Is it moist? You know. I'm, yeah. I'm gonna, if I could throw something at you right now, I'd yeah, throw something at you. Really yeah, you, you can see the carrots and nuts into it and everything. And oh, yeah, yeah, but you can see it. <laughs> I was doing it right in front of the camera. You hear him? He's like, if I could throw something at you right now. <laughs> I was in there eating it in front of him. Let me find out he likes the nuts too. The what? I said, let me find out he likes the nuts too. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> You know there ain't no dumb moment with me, bro. Yeah, no, yeah. no, 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 chill, no, no, call me the mode. <laughs> I was gonna say no chill mode either. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. That's it. Where are you going? Oh. Oh, oh, he can go blow up the toilet. He can go try to test it. Our toilets are battle tested. They're good. <laughs> They're good. They've oh, served, he's, they, he's tested them before. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Uh, I don't think they're the rest of them. He has been tested. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. And the kids were there. Yeah. Oh, man, it wasn't clean so they couldn't go fishing? Yep. <laughs> they could not go anywhere until they cleaned their room. My uh, junior has a baseball game today, so we're all like, you need to clean your room before you go. Yep. 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 That's a good way to do it. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, yeah, that's the same with our son and the girls. Uh, they're into track, baseball, basketball, and dance Jeez. between the three of them. And what's the matter? Yeah, yeah. yeah they, they ain't, your room ain't clean, clothes ain't folded, put up. Y'all ain't going. Right. Like, yeah, you know, you ain't, you ain't coming back. You're gonna be all the yeah. eighteen. Where at? They're in uh, Annabelle. Annabelle. No, oh, okay. Yeah, my. The kids are playing tonight over here at the uh, Boys and Girls Club for basketball. Oh, okay. Uh, oh. Their first basketball game of the season. They've been playing baseball really? at the school and stuff. You see, Ozai wanted to get into basketball, but I didn't know where to put him in. And I'm like, okay. So it's only Ozai wanted to play baseball, but he only wanted to hit. Hey, you want to be running and pitching? Like, no, put me in the. Uh, what is it? What is it? The, I'm sure you hit it hard, but you know the alternate, the alternate batter or whatever. <laughs> I'll hit and you run. <laughs> no, you cannot. Sorry, you cannot. Hey, I'll swing the bat. You stay right there. If it goes, you run. <laughs> so where am I now? No. And he's all like, Mom, I want to play basketball. I'm like, you do you realize you have to run up and down the court, everything. He goes, okay, well, uh, basketball's coming up at the school, so that's until after school over. So. We'll see. Yeah. Now, actually, when my kids go to school, they actually started up their... Uh, uh, what? I got I to gotta lower it down. So, 
Oh, wait, uh, music? Yeah. He's, no, that that will pick it up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it'll pick it up. I'll, I'll look at it once, once, it, well, once I'm not on. Uh, uh, open. Okay. Yeah. Our flag out there looks so awesome. I don't know if y'all have seen the videos. That we finally got our flags up there and stuff like that. So, yeah. Pit, pit, pinch hitter. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, they got a Doberman. It's the one that's in on some of my TikToks and uh, the video shorts. Let's see. Show on. Where's he at? 80s. What up, oh. boy? What up? Yeah. Yeah, he was real rambunctious when, when we first got introduced. And you don't sneak up on him at night. <laughs> and that was the scary thing, too, because, I mean, he was right there by the rack, you know, uh, when we were out there, but... When the rods would take off, everybody was running by, and he, yeah, he was protecting the rack like if you were moving too quick. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> There's one time when we're 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 down. And uh, dude, I had, I had a monster run, dude, on, on my fin on my uh, finor. To the flag finor, it was it was like three o'clock. And we're all crashed out, dude. And that reel starts screaming, bro. And this dude is. Like he wants to climb up. That's when I have my trailer. Yeah. He wants to climb up my trailer. Just fucking <laughs> just. <laughs> at the rod growing up. And I get out that, that, that cot, the cot tent. I'm out that thing. And I'm thinking. Rod's <laughs> <laughs> I can't find him. I can't find him. You didn't you want to move without knowing where he was at. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. No, definitely. <laughs> and Candace has a picture where I'm on pod wheel. And then, uh, get a start. Uh, the one that, that brought that, uh, I would lend you for your 130. Mm -hmm. uh, we got the tea, and the boys are standing up on the rail looking over. Oh, yeah. Well, this dude, like, uh, he's he standing on the rail and he's in the rail. I want to know what's going on, too. Like. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Let's see. Um, what are you doing? <laughs> are you? Are you? Are you? All right. So no. I'm gonna go All buy right. some uh, adult water. I you had some there. You, you're up here, and I. Oh my god. No, I just got smart. I don't yeah. leave it where everybody can get to it. <laughs> No, it's quick and easy access. Oh, oh, no. It don't need to be cold. <laughs> you saw how I was way over here. <laughs> oh, no. Don't think of me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's he's one of them them guys. They uh... <laughs> later, guys. <laughs> All right, guys. So we are at five forty eight. Cutoff is at six o'clock, and we're at two hundred and forty dollars. I'm gonna go ahead and check Cash App real quick. Oh nope, we're at two hundred and eighty. Christopher has been there. No. Oh. Yeah, we're at two hundred and eighty dollars in tonight's fire drawing, and let's see. Uh, oh, excuse me. There ain't no excuse for you. Later, bro. You have a good one, man. So now we're at $300. There's John Darnell taking it to the three. You ever seen Narnia, TJ? Yeah, yeah great movie. <laughs> now we're saying it's a great movie. Yeah. Yeah, there's actually several of them. There's Nar Narnia, there's Chronicles of Narnia, and, and I know there's, there's several of them. We're at $300 right there, guys. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. oh, man. 
Oh, that he was, Hyman. That that dog was like he was zeroed in. <laughs> he was zeroed in. I don't know if he remembers me or not, but it's been a while since I've seen him. So probably probably would have to smell me to remember who I was or whatever. So, but yeah, it's just at night when he was there at camp, you couldn't you know you couldn't surprise him at night. You know what I mean? Because he'd, oh. <laughs> he'd tear you up. But, but oh. even then, you know, you took the long way around because I guess they were saying he doesn't have real good vision at night or whatever. So, well, they said he didn't. Like, he, he that's why he was like, turn on the lights because even if it, yeah, it's his dog, like, and it was barking to, to do whatever, he didn't want to run up on the dog trying to get past him. You know what I mean? So, yeah. So. <sighs> oh, yeah. All right, guys. So we're at 300. And y'all got 10 minutes, guys. 10 more minutes, and we're outies on this. But, yeah, so we're going to go pick up a block of lead tomorrow. We got Avid Reels on the way. We got Tightline Braid on the way. I got a crap load of three-way swivels today. Um, group Pen Slammer 5, 10,000 selection. But we mainly use for drops off the beach. I am thinking 50 pounds. 100, 200, 200. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And Suggestions as to what manufacturer of line? Is that what you're asking? Or yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yes, sir. Yep. I'm, I'm de like I said, I'm on the kayak. I, I, I definitely could feel that I was out of shape and stuff like that, but I am doing exercises at the house, you know, leg lifts and stuff like that. So that way, obviously, it's nothing like getting on the kayak and kayak and bait. But uh, I'm definitely going to be getting out there. Um, I want to get a secondary pedal kayak like that. So that way, when we take off out there, we got two to play with. And, and that way, we we always got a backup and stuff like that. So Good to have one. And, and I think the Chihuahua thing is... Not because of uh, that they don't like anybody. It's just because everybody's bigger than them, and they feel like they got a Napoleon complex. The, the Napoleon complex. Yeah, yeah. I remember one time. They're more terrorizing than anything. Yeah, they tear up your ankles. <laughs> no, hey, it took. Never, uh, well, I read one time there was a uh, lady was walking her dog, and uh, her dog left, and uh, she said a, a pack of twenty dozen chihuahuas came out and mm -hmm. killed her. <laughs> they took the ankles out. Of it. Damn it! They took, they took the ankles out, and she went down. <laughs> Jesus! You think the pictures? I don't know. I'm just thinking how many punts you know would it take to get all of them over a fence? <laughs> I don't know, man. Yeah. I was, I was <laughs> looking at one. I saw where some. Uh, Chihuahuas were barking like that through a fence, and then the, the fence kept opening, and they kept just moving along with the fence <laughs> until the fence wasn't there, and then they, they were looking at each other, and they stopped barking. <laughs> so, yeah, no. Uh, great overturned on chicken, rice, legs, vegetables have been put in the microwave to warm up. Nice. So uh, I got a video that I got to, I don't know if I already edited and put it out there. It's a video short or a regular video. Um, but I don't know if y'all missed it or not, but it was a dinner that the wife cooked last night. You know, not in the shorts. It might be in the TikTok. Let me see. <laughs> uh, okay, no, go back. Okay. Nope. It's not even in there, so I, I got a video I got to edit and put out there. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Aww. All right, there's Roger in here for the fire, so we're at $320. Make sure, let me go back up, make sure I didn't miss anybody. John Darnell was the last one. Yep. Yeah. We're at $320. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, and, and, and once you put a, any kind of motor on any kind of vessel, <laughs> you have to register it, which means now it has to wear TX numbers as well, even though it's a pedal drive kayak and you put a motor on it. Yeah, it, it'll have to be registered like that with insurance and all of that too. So, 
And, and but you got to remember too, even though you have that on there, if you're prepping for Sharkathon, you won't be able to use it. So that's why a lot of these upgrades of using drones and doing all of that, I never got into because I knew I could not use them during the biggest tournament of the year. So now that I don't fish that tournament because you know they cheated me out of the winnings. The only reason I'm getting into a pedal drive kayak is so that way I can show my guys how to do it and ensure that they got somebody confident and capable to run out there with them and go to the deep and then, you know, keep doing it over and over so that way they can build their confidence level and all of that so that way they ain't got to worry about it. But also, too, there's there's a lot of things you can't teach by talking about it. Later, boss, you have a good weekend, man, and good job on that. Look back there, you can see the whole thing lit up and stuff like that. So, thank you, sir. West Columbia tomorrow. Cool deal. Um, all right, guys, 555. Y'all got five minutes, and we're at $320 for tonight's fire drawing. I'm going to check cash out real quick. And then, obviously, here in a few minutes, I'm going to go and set us up over there, but I got to use the rest of the first. I'm going to wait for Jeff to get back, and then I'll. Go and start moving us on that one. Uh, oh, yes. And I definitely want to get back to the pier because I'm going to do some heavy distance casting. So, all right, guys, I'll be right back. I'm going to go use the restroom and then we'll get, get on with the drawing. Yeah. I've been busy, Homer. Hey, Gray, Edgar. <laughs> oh, man. You know, that sometimes it's always, or sometimes it's just good. Tough if they learn how to humble themselves. Yeah, that's, dude, that's all I was asking for. Just be humble about it and. Wouldn't do that. He'd rather be the, the chihuahua. <laughs> so, ah. All right, guys. Give me a second. Let me get my tripod over here. What do you think, Gallert? I like that. Let's see. Is that is that a twenty five ounce or is that the sixteen? It's a oh, twelve. It's a sixteen, but yeah. it's the same that's diameter as a twelve. Oh, okay, so it's not the twenty five. That's not mine. Okay. No. Yeah, I, I want the twenty five. <laughs> <laughs> that yours right here. Hold on, hold on, boss. You said that I was excited. Y'all mine? Well, it's one of them I'm sending to you. Oh, my God. oh, okay. I'm putting that on yours. Nice. Nice. Hell yeah. So, uh, I had to move out of the Ziploc bag because uh, you got too many tickets. It's already empty there. Good. Touche, Carl. Touche. What did Carl say? My phone's not active. Hold on a second. He said my new my new nickname is Garden Gnome. <laughs> I like that. I like that. that yeah, that, that totally totally fits you, bro. <laughs> All right, let's see. All right, so it's five fifty nine. Y'all got one minute, guys. 
We're at three hundred and twenty dollars. Yeah, no I don't see any more here on the feed, so I'm gonna check these. Uh, the catch up and then go ahead and call it. Yeah, I'm just glad we got a lot of those rails coming in. It's been it's been a minute. It's been a real minute, so yeah, I know, Edgar. It's yeah, it's it's gonna be there for a while. Damn it, Carl. <laughs> sure that. All right, it's six o'clock. Let me I'm checking. We got nothing on the super chat. I'm gonna go and check cash app. Daniel, can you come over here so we can give you a book? Come on, buddy. Nothing on cash app. All right. Here we go, guys. I'm going to show everybody the tickets first. <laughs> there we go. Never, Carl. Never. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I got a feeling that Edgar set my nickname to uh, Garden Gnome in the in the team chat. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here, team, take it. Carl, if you said a hat like that, uh, I'd wear it. You know I would. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. No, no. I'm coming, Daniel. You can sit over there. Got one. Oh, sure. Break the glass. Christopher Skosh. There we go. Congratulations. So that's 320. Yep, yep. How you doing, boss? Just finished doing a fire drawing. <laughs> yes. I'll be right with y'all. <laughs> there we go. So, be 32. So, that takes our green cross up to $1,083 right there. Got that, got that, and hey, you remember that guy I was telling you about? Uh, had the Frankenstein lures. Uh, sounds familiar, but I don't remember the story. What's up? He, he makes, he makes those soft plastic baits. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Dude, check out the, the vinyl that he's able to stick on these hats. Oh, nice. I th wait, I think I've seen that. Uh, didn't you have a, a leather one or something like that? A leather hat like that? Or, or you made something in leather? Yeah. I did a, a sleeve for him for his injection molds. And uh -huh. I put that uh, that color shifting paint on there, which is basically the same thing that does, except mine's paint and his is a sticker. <laughs> oh, nice. All right, Christopher, you don't have paperwork with us, but you got $288 worth of credit in shop. So. <clears throat> got it. <laughs> <laughs> Carl, you said Smoky Gnome, and the first thing I thought of was Smoky from Friday. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's one way to that's one way to do it. <laughs> oh, 
Awesome. Well, all right, guys. So that took care of that. And I said it, it, today was all levels of growth all the way around. And uh, like I said, it, it for a minute there when I saw that, man, it just stopped me in my tracks and just you feel a, a whole load of, you know, just uncertainty just get lifted off and stuff like that. So, again, guys, like I said, I'm, I'm extremely happy for getting all the, the, the good news that we got all the way around, you know, real being shipped out today and the quantity they're being shipped out in, you know, get, getting our, my disability rating, got my, my lifetime hunting and fishing license. So now I'm, I'm open to all kinds of stuff. And then tomorrow I'll go to pick up a big old block of lead. Um, probably, I don't know if I get back early enough, maybe I'll go fishing or something. I don't know. I don't know, but all right, guys, y'all have a good one. And we'll check y'all later. Jacob, thank you very much for chiming in with us and stuff like that. We definitely, got, we definitely got to do something to, to help you cross that bridge to get down here and fish and stuff like that. Well, so, uh, I will I'm going to get back, that. I'm gonna get back with Beach Bomber because he did call me when I was uh, live on the channel. I, was, uh, uh, I don't know if he needed to ask me a question, but I told him I was live here so he could chime in. But uh, I guess he was too busy editing on, on the phone or whatever. So, uh, <laughs> But yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's just grouchy Santa. <laughs> there you go. There you go. <laughs> All right, guys. Y'all have a good one. Y'all be safe. And I will talk to y'all later. Y'all have a good one.